Good morning and welcome to another edition of Bill Johnson's Serial Reviews. I'm your host, Bill Johnson, with uh, another special guest today. Smiles. And Smiles and Professor X are my sons. This is my other best friend. What's going on? What's up? <laughs> and today, Oops. we're going to have some fun with Funfetti Cereal. Now, Funfetti is a cake mix to make cupcakes and cakes and things like that. I don't know anything about it. I don't have any frame of reference to compare it to, except for the fact that I see that now they have Funfetti pancakes. So if these are any good, I'll be seeking those out. Um, the back of the box here is pretty cool. It's got brain games, find 15 silly things, a word find the perfect cereal box this is made by pillsbury 16 grams of sugar oof and uh, 180 sodium uh, pillsbury is in the cereal game last time they teamed up with general mills to make uh, cinnamon roll fillos i believe and those were not the best cereal but not a bad dry snack what did you think of those i thought they were good my kids like everything, <laughs> literally. You could put dog poo in a bowl, and as long as it came in a box that had a good artwork, they'd be like, it's pretty good. Ew. Wow. I just took us there. I'm sorry. Dog poo. Funfetti. <laughs> Let's open it fresh. Should we redo this review? Because I said dog poo? No. I don't think so. I, That's not how this game works. Because I saw your video yesterday with Professor X. I like you a lot. Did you? Yeah. That was the smart food uh, popcorn. Mm -hmm. Captain Crunch. Smells okay. Smells like birthday cake. I'm going to pile it high. And I'm going to pile it deep. Let me help you out. I'm going to pile it high and deep for you, too. All right. So let's try it dry first. Let's show everybody what, what we got here. Whoa. Uh, funfetti, it just basically looks like kicks with, you know, little uh, red and blue sprinkles on it. Now let's try it dry. Definitely tastes like cake. Yeah. Not great dry though. It gets a little pasty. Like cake batter. What do you think? It's making my mouth dry. Mm. It's weird. I don't know. Let's add the milk, mm -hmm. see if there's an improvement. Not off to a great start, Funfetti. I need a little I'm going to help you out. Mm -hmm. Because we just opened this milk. And if there's anything I know about smiles, he makes a mess. <laughs> but he is my man. All right, you ready? Mm-hmm. Let's do this. Let's do this. I'm hoping the milk was a vast improvement. Still has that weird kind of pasty experience. I can't explain it. Maybe it's because Pillsbury is just not, uh, you know, they're new to the cereal game, but
can't explain it. So it, it's a little off, but mm -hmm. go ahead. What's your analysis, sir? Well, it's it tastes good, but I think it starts to like wear off just a little bit. I agree. The initial bite is the flavor, and then it sort of dissipates. Um, the box says bursting with fun. First off, I don't know if I want to eat anything that's bursting. And second off, uh, I think that that is false advertising. This is not bursting with anything. Mm. Okay. I've given my analysis. What's your rating? I think I'm gonna give it a six. Good thing we bought the family size. He's right. It's a six. Um, just something weird about this cereal. Yeah, the flavor is okay. It's terrible dry. Um, once you add the milk, it still has that weird pasty situation. It is kind of a gum cutter. It's hard to explain because it turns into powder so quick. The flavor wears off, and it's like, you know, just a generic cakey cereal. This is uh, this one's a miss. Funfetti's a miss. So I would like to say like, subscribe, comment down below, and put that on your spoon and eat it. Yeah, put it on your spoon. <laughs> All right. Sorry, guys. This one is a loss. Bye.